Hi there, thanks for tuning in. This is Miss H's messages today, trying out some ColourPop lipsticks for you so that you can see what it looks like on Indian or brown skin. Stay tuned. So the first color I'm starting off with is a pretty dark, intense color. It's the kind of color that says, you know, if you come at me, tomorrow's going to be your funeral. So it's intense, but gorgeous. So Dukes might be a color you use for nighttime, but this shade is a really nice color for daytime. It's very nude, pale, light, and just makes you look very sweet, even though you're not. This next color has a pretty interesting effect on me. It reminds me of that psychic vampire from Twilight. You know, the one with the crazy eyes. Yeah, like if vampires could be good, this is the lipstick that they would wear. I don't know, I can't put my finger on why I love it so much. It's kind of like a, a cheeky plum color. Okay, this color I think is probably one of my favorites of the entire video. Like, I did not want to take this off. It just looks like cafe latte on your lips. And it's just absolutely gorgeous. You have to understand as a brown girl, it's not easy to find a nude lippy shade. So when you find one, you don't take it off. Like it? Okay, to spice things up, I am trying the Blotted Lip Lipstick. So the Blotted Lip is a completely different product from the Lippy Sticks. And I don't exactly know what the differences are, but when you try on the product, you can definitely see and feel the difference. So the Blotted Lip has more of like a Korean makeup feel to it. It's very natural and light. And Lippy Sticks has a more Kim Kardashian West Kylie Lip Kit vibe, so that's the main difference. Okay, so now I'm trying on the second of my blotted lip. This one is called Ice Cube, and even though in the tube, the color looks very similar to the previous blotted lip but as you can see when I apply it um, the product on your lip is very sheer it's a very natural light tint to your lips it's kind of sexy I think um, in a very innocent a good girl kind of way and not gonna lie it does feel a lot nicer on your lips to the lipsticks. Man, they are not playing around with these caps for the lipsticks because it's like a workout to get it open. Okay, so um, moving back to the lippy sticks, I think you can see that with very little application, you get a very strong color. The great thing about lippy sticks is that it provides the color and coverage of liquid lipstick but without that drying stickiness that usually comes with it. Alrighty, coming down to the final stretch with lippy number 6. Out of all the lip colors that I got in this parcel, I think this is the one that I would probably have the most difficult time um, trying to wear because I really don't know how to do makeup for this. I can't, I can't put a finger on what kind of vibe it puts out. Maybe it's a summery vibe, I guess, because it's got peach undertones. 
Um, yeah, so this is Cammy. I guess it just takes a little bit of getting used to since I don't have anything like this colour in my collection. But it does remind me of the lip colour I had a long time ago from the brand, brand Silky Girl called Iced Tea. I love that lippy. And now we move on to the last shade, the last lippy sticks colour. So in total I had nine um, lip items and a couple of eyeshadows. I'll probably do another video for that. But if you liked this, then yeah, please show some love. And if you have any comments, you want to share which color you think looked the best or which one you're interested in getting, then please do so in the comments section below. The last color is called Daydream. This color reminds me of autumn leaves and pumpkin spice latte. I don't have anything like it in my collection, so yeah. <laughs> okay guys, hello and welcome to this video. I need to put some lip balm on because after trying on all those colors and taking all of them off, my lips are like so dry. Oh, it's so much better. So I received a parcel from Colourpop today which contained all the stuff that I ordered during their buy one free one sale. And I have seven color sticks, color pop sticks, seven color pop sticks. And the colors here were New Rules, Pillow Talk, Tootsie, Dukes, Daydream, Cami, and LBB. So aside from trying the color sticks, I had two more items called the Blotted Lip. And the Blotted Lip came in Bee's Knees and Ice Cube. So I'm just going to tell you a little bit about my experience trying on these colors. Between the two, between the Blotted Lip and the Lippy Sticks, I am a fan of the lippy sticks and I'll tell you why. First of all, um, it's very pigmented. These, this product definitely goes on very strong in one swipe. So you really get a lot for what you pay for and the tubes are obviously a little bit longer. You probably get a little bit more product compared to the blotted lip. Um, that being said though, the blotted lip is a great product if you're going for the lip tint kind of look. It's a very Korean makeup, very natural uh, light, not very pigmented look. Uh, the color is beautiful actually. I really did like the color but I didn't enjoy the application. It was very hard to get on my lips and it almost felt like I was drying my lips out. That being said though, I have, I did try seven different lipsticks and take them off seven different times so it could also be that my lips were very dry when I tried this on and that could be affecting how the product applies. Okay guys, so that's all for my makeup haul today. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!